It's just metadata. That's been a popular defense of the NSA surveillance program, but one that many computer scientists dispute. There would be quite a lot you could learn about the ordinary American. Metadata includes details like the number dialed, the time of the call, and duration. Just how sensitive is that information? According to research done by Stanford PhD student Jonathan Mayer and his partner, very. They created an Android app, Metaphone that asked users to volunteer their phone records in an effort to learn what can be uncovered from metadata. More than 500 people signed up. We began by identifying the organizations associated with the phone numbers in our data set. And we did that primarily using phone books provided by Yelp and by Google. Totally public, totally easy to access. With the help of Facebook's phone directory feature, people search services and Google, more than 90% of the numbers were quickly identified. We uh, noted when a business was uh, a firearms dealer. We noted when a, uh, a business was a health service provider. Users also place calls to religious organizations, financial services, and marijuana dispensaries. It all raises very real privacy concerns about what happens when our phone records and public information reveal very personal affairs. In Stanford, California, I'm Sumi Das, CNET.com for CBS News.